guys how are y'all doing today i hope you guys are doing so so good out there for today's video i'm going to be showing you guys all of my updated favorite list of travel bags backpacks pouches and organizational items literally like a travel organizational smorgasbord <laughs> jeremy and i are in like that zone where we're trying to like knock out some travel before we start working on getting a kid brewing in this stomach <laughs> and this year so far i have hawaii on my list and we're going to be going to spain for a five-year wedding anniversary so i recently just like upgraded a lot of different things to try out some new brands and i'm just always on the hunt for like the best of the best so i wanted to share all my findings with you guys today and i hope you guys really enjoy as always everything mentioned in today's video will be down below in the description box along with some affordable alternatives because i did upgrade a lot of my things to more premium items but there's still so many great affordable alternatives on amazon so i'll be sure to include all that down below for you guys and also in the blog post so be sure to check that out all right you guys on that note let's go ahead and get started Woo. all right guys starting off with our larger size bags and moving on down to the tiny little organizational pieces Start off with my favorite travel backpack, you guys. This is the eBags TLS Motherload Weekender Backpack in size junior. Y'all, we fight over this backpack every time we travel. And this backpack comes on every single trip with us. The greatest thing about this backpack is it's almost like a weekender and backpack hybrid. It fits so much stuff in here you would not believe and all of the compartments are like so thoughtfully designed and you have lots of very high volume compartments. So the guts of this backpack you actually have a really big space and this is where you can put all of your clothes, your packing cubes, just like the main bulk of the backpack. It's got a nice great expansion. It's got a padded back panel where you put your laptops. I always carry around like two laptops with me so I actually stick my own vertical access laptop sleeves that I got at Amazon. So I have like this like padded shell for both laptops that I could just quickly take out. And then this front pocket actually fits a lot of stuff in here. It goes really, really deep. You have tons of little organizational pockets. And my favorite pocket is this one up here on the top. This is where you can do all of your quick access things. Like I put my keys, my wallet, my plane ticket, all of that can go right here in the front. So this backpack is so great for functionality and also high volume. Gotta check this guy out. They also come in a larger size since this is the junior size and it comes in several really cute colors. Moving on to our travel duffel. I always bring one with me. Even if I'm bringing like a really nice like leather bag, I will encase it in a duffel or tote bag so that it protects it. First two favorites are gonna be from Away. If you guys are new to the channel, I literally have converted to 100% Away suitcase luggages. Y'all, it is like the best. It has been some of our favorite investments. They are the most sturdy, chic, functional and just like glides beautifully through like any terrain which I really really appreciate so if you guys are looking for a more in-depth review on the luggage suitcases I'll include my blog post below for you guys to check out but today we're gonna talk about their actual duffel bags this first one is this smaller size one the first one they released this is the away everywhere bag this is really great for just a very simple commute this is great for just the essentials it can hold all your basic personal needs in addition to like a cardigan magazine bullet journal all that stuff can go handily right in here and it slips underneath the seat for a super convenient fit you also have a little hidden pocket in the front and also this panel in the back that slides perfectly over your luggage handles now my favorite combination the travel uniform is this guy paired with the bigger carry-on bag it's great for just a couple day trip tons of rave reviews for this bag you also have a crossbody strap so that you can wear it more comfortably I've had this bag since the holiday season and I really really love it but if I do need something a little bit heavier your duty. I've got their big sister, the Weekender that just got released. I'm gonna be taking this onto my next trip and I cannot wait to try it out. This is a duffel bag that's great if you need the same capacity size as a carry-on luggage. You can see how much larger the interior is in here. You can actually fit like all of your clothes into the interior panel. You still have some great simple pocketed and open pockets on the inside and then you actually have a padded laptop sleeve which is actually so unique to find in like a duffel bag. I really like the fact that it can fit my 15 inch laptop in here and it's got a nice cushion padding to protect it. And then on the other side, you actually have full pockets on the 
entire length of the bag. You have a zippered pocket here for your wallet and your cell phone, and then you have a smaller one here for more discreet items. I also really love this bag too, because just like the everywhere bag, you have a generous panel that you can slip your suitcase handle through, and this guy fits perfectly on my large away suitcase. Oh, I almost forgot. One of the best features of this bag is you have this secret pocket on the side where you can fit a pair of shoes. And look at that. I was just looking for this pair of shoes and I thought that I lost them. So inside here, you can actually put your arm all the way through to the other end of the bag. I can fit about like three pairs of shoes really comfortably here on the bottom. So it really gives you full carry-on suitcase capabilities. Also, this little shoe compartment is lined in like a durable kind of material so you can easily wipe it down in case any of the shoes you put in here are kind of messy. Can't wait to take this one on my next trip. This is definitely the size I was looking for because your girl is not that much of a light packer. <laughs> if you guys are interested in how I actually pack, I have a trip to Hawaii coming up this month and I'm gonna do a pack with me video so you guys can see me put everything into all these pieces. Next piece, this is my latest and greatest favorite like large size tote bag. Again, I'm always kind of like testing the limits of how big the personal item can be on a plane. <laughs> so my new obsession is this brand called Dagny Dover. Most of their hero items are all made out of this really cool neoprene material. They come in so many exotic and beautiful colors. And this is the London carry-all bag in the size large. It comes in extra small all the way up to extra large. I really wanted something that was just like very loose and free form so I could just like jam a bunch of stuff in there. Also, I normally bring a really nice like purse or like tote bag with me and I don't want it to get scratched. So I actually put my nice handbag into the interior of a bag like this so that it actually protects it as I'm traveling. This bad boy has a big interior space but it also has really nice functional mesh pockets on each side. You have a zipper pocket here and then also just a loose one here. And then it also gives you this really cool key clip with a cute mesh pouchette so that you can put your smaller items that you don't wanna lose into the expanse of this big ass bag. And then on the outside you have this cute little secret phone compartment, which is so handy when you're walking through the airport because you can just drop your phone in here and you don't have to dig inside. Have it open completely like this, or you can fold down the side flaps to condense the size a little bit more and make it more of like a duffel shape and more manageable when you're walking. Now, I really love this bag a lot. The only thing that I have noticed on my last few trips is that the straps are starting to pill, but overall the neoprene is incredibly lightweight. I've been really, really liking this bag. Moving on to the organizational smaller pieces. Next up, let's talk about packing cubes. My favorite ones that I've been using like consistently the past six months has been the away packing cubes. I mentioned in my last year's video that the Amazon e-bags and dot and dot collections are still always going to be my favorite affordable finds, but Jeremy has actually been using these sets a lot more and I've been exclusively using the away ones. I've had this sand color one since last year and I just picked up this white one. The reason why I've been using these is because the actual pocket I find is a lot taller and I'm able to stack a lot more clothes into these packing cubes. I also really love the sizes that they give you in the six pack. I find that each of them serves a very specific purpose. Like I use this wide one to put on my bras and it just makes organization so, so easy for me. So in addition to the height and the size, I love the aesthetic, of course. It is so minimalist and beautiful. It makes packing and unpacking like a super aesthetically pleasing experience and they fit so well in all of my luggage. Been absolutely loving these. If you guys are interested in the more affordable options, I will still link my favorite collections from the e-bags and dot and dot from Amazon for you guys down below. Next favorite item that we always use are shoe bags. I'm like a total germaphobe, so like all the shoes need to be like protected and like not touching the other things. So I wanted to give you guys an update on my favorite shoe bags. I have been using this really cute set that I got off Amazon and I've been using them on so many trips and these have been my favorite longest lasting ones. I like that they have a pop of color, especially since my packing cubes are so minimalist. Like they contrast really well inside my suitcase and I also really really like that you get different colors. So I kind of have like a mental designation for each one of these and I just can't believe how well they've been holding up. So I will link this set down below for you guys. And then for Jeremy's shoes, he needs a bigger one cause he's a dude and 
they got bigger feet. <laughs> so I just bought this set online, also from Amazon. He likes just the classic black color. So this one seems to be um, a lot thicker than the last pair we got him. So I'll link these down below for you guys too. We tried to put his shoes in this little dinky pink bag and it was like not working out. So to show you guys the size comparison, these simple black ones definitely give you a lot more space to fit a larger shoe. Moving on to toiletry bags, I've got three different styles to show you guys depending on what your preference is. First one, I actually grabbed this just like totally on a whim. We were staying in a tiny house and I realized that there was gonna be like no counter space. So I was like, hmm, I need to try a toiletry bag that can actually hang up and be suspended in the air. I got this little small hanging toiletry bag from eBags. Definitely one of the favorite petite size ones that I've ever found because it has such a nice wide bottom. I was able to fit in all of my bottles so easily in here. I also would take this on something like a cruise ship where there wouldn't be counter space, not have to take something in and out of my luggage every single time I need it. Toiletry bag number two, back into the Dagny Dover obsession. I also picked up their Hunter toiletry bag. You guys, if you're into just like an amorphous blob where you can just throw all your crap in there like this is the bag for you same really nice soft pliable neoprene material this toiletry bag can fit so much stuff in there I just took this Heather Gray one on a bachelorette trip and you guys I still have all my stuff in here as you guys can see I was able to fit all of my lotions deodorants cream samples and another cool feature is that they come again with all these really handy mini organizing inserts they're all made out of mask so I was able to put like my toothbrush and my toothpaste into this one and then this larger one I put all of my cotton pads in there <laughs> so even though this feels like this huge unorganized expanse these little pouchettes do a really great job also same functionality as the tote bag I showed you guys you can fold the side zippers down and buckle them up if you need a more compact space or you can expand them for maximum volume and then the same thing going on you've got tons of different colors and you also have multiple sizes depending on your needs I have this one in large which I love so much but I also bought it in the extra large because if I have a longer trip I think I will really utilize and enjoy this one and last but not least I wanted to shout this one out again I've shown this on my channel several times but you guys the away mini suitcases this is my favorite small hard case toiletry bag the thing that I love about this one is not only is it super compact and like it compresses everything together but if you guys have really delicate things that always like explode or get cracked and you're just terrified of leakage this is like the ultimate protection against that I also like because it's so modular it fits really well into like little nooks and crannies like I fit so much stuff in this tiny thing I can stand it vertically and it literally takes up just such a small footprint into your suitcase so also need to mention aesthetically like to match it with your cute little pink bag like to die for all right moving on to my favorite cosmetic bags you could kind of say that it's like the same as a toiletry bag but these specifically I've been really loving for my makeup organization the first brand is gonna be from Stony Clover Lane. I found this brand, I think in Thanksgiving time, but one thing I really love about it is their bags are slim yet structured, and I love the durable like nylon fabric in addition to that clear panel. I am obsessed with clear panels for my makeup. I feel like I know exactly what I put in there. I can find things so much quicker, and I have these two favorites that I like to use. This one right here, I take on every single trip. I keep all of my really simple, quick access essentials in here. I put my eye drops, my face powder, and my hand sanitizer in this one. I keep it right next to my wallet in my handbag. And I believe this is the small case, but this one is really great for a light to medium trip. I have all my makeup essentials in here from my foundation, my concealer if I have a little mini eyeshadow palette it would definitely fit in here but you actually be very surprised at how much you could jam pack the slim silhouette of this bag is great because it just takes such a small footprint up in your suitcase or you can just lay it up on top like it's very very compact and I really appreciate that this panel is so large so I can see literally everything that's in this guy and the zipper is just so thick and durable like I have packed this thing to the gills and it keeps everything in next favorite if you guys follow like a lot of beauty gurus like this this has been a hot buy. You can buy these big, hard case makeup bags off Amazon for a really affordable price. This one I like to take with me if I'm doing any type of like serious, heavy duty makeup. For example, I've done like makeup for several of my friend's weddings before. So this bad boy is just so great to have. Deep pockets for all of your key makeup items. I like that it's customizable. You can take these dividers out and adjust them to what you need. And then you have a top pocket where you can 
fit brushes. And I just like the fact that I could prop this open and it almost functions as like a very professional like makeup setup. Super affordable for only $20. I think this is the 10 and a half inch size, but they also have a 15 inch size. Also, if you don't like to have like a thousand different bags and pouches like I do, you can also combine your toiletries and your makeup all in one case and just be done with it. All right guys, and the last two brands I'm gonna show you are gonna be super brand new that I just started testing out. The first brand is gonna be a brand called Truffle and they make my favorite completely clear pouches and bags. I have been using these two so far. This one is the mini clutch and this is the small pouch. These guys are great for complete visibility and also very slim, compact storage. I like using these for makeup items but also things outside of makeup like cords or pens, travel documents, passports. Like this is just a very modern and ultra chic way to travel. All of the outer edges are made out of soft piano leather. These have been just so fabulous for traveling. I still love my affordable Amazon ones of course but I definitely appreciate the full transparency. I can see exactly what cords I have. And because I love these so much I actually bought a couple of their travel cases. These are very similar to the Pop and Suki cases that I showed you guys in my last travel video. I actually gave those over to my mom to use because I wanted to try these out. These have that full clear panel on the top and the bottom which I think is so cool because you can fit an entire layer of products on this side and then flip it over and have a completely different set of things on this more shallow side. This one is the jumbo case. I cannot wait to take this on a test run and show you guys how well it does. And then I also have a smaller one. I purchased these as an upgrade for my Pop and Suki cases. And the last makeup pouch that I just picked up, I literally have had enough with my last makeup brush case. I found that my brushes would just roll everywhere and I just had no organization and all of the dust and powders would stain everything. So I found this one that I'm going to give a shot. This one is from the company Stephanie Johnson and I got this at Nordstrom. This is exactly what I was looking for. This is a shallow but sizable long pouch that includes a fully protected interior so that I can wipe up any creams or powders that stain. I like that you have this open area where I can throw all my larger brushes and then all of my smaller detail ones could fit in these designated little holes and it comes with a protective flap. I have seen the Stephanie Johnson line a lot at Nordstrom so I'm really excited to give this brand a shot. I find that this would be a really great case just for my brushes and then I can put my makeup in either my truffle jumbo case or my smaller stony clothes over small case. All right, you guys, that does it for today's video. I will include everything mentioned and shown in today's video down below in the description box. You will also see that I had these cute little containers that I was stuffing in a lot of these things. So I'll include the links to all these cute little accoutrements down below for you guys too. They're all really affordable things off of Amazon that I use for like my hand soaps and my pills and stuff like that. So I wanna thank you guys so much for joining me today. If you guys are taking any big trips this year, I'm so excited for you. I hope you have safe and exciting and fun rewarding travels me and jeremy are so excited for our next like year to two year journey exploring more places together if you guys have not followed me already please hit me up at, at miss ej louie on all my social media and chat up your girl i love to hear from you guys i hope you're having an amazing blessed day out there and i love you guys so so much bye